This is a video response to the question, can you use the Unifix cubes in place of the Matthew C blocks for the Matthew C program? And the short answer is yes, you can. It takes a little bit more effort on the part of the parent or the teacher. Um, but here are a few suggestions. If you are going to try and use Unifix, I would definitely try and match up the colors that they use for Matthew C with, with your blocks. So the four, I would make that yellow and just have your child leave that four together. Um, the, one of the reasons for that is they give them little quirky ways of remembering some of the blocks. For example, three is three little pigs and eight is chocolate. So and then they have the vanilla seven. So they do come up with ways to remember it. So it helps, especially if you're watching the video from Mr. Demi. If the student's watching that, it's helpful for them to see the correlation that he has the same color or similar color to what blocks they have. Now you'll see that the Matthew C ones don't come apart like the Unifix, which is nice um, so that they're not, you know, maybe not counting as much. They see this color and they know exactly what number it is. Um, they can count these, little, they can count these still, but you know, this is a little bit easier. This can fall apart. Um, but it can definitely be done. And if you've done this before, feel free to comment below and tell us how it's worked for you. As far as using it, them with the workbook, there are pages that are printed to size. So you'll see that it's easier if you have the right size for that. Now you could come up with your own worksheets, um, but since these blocks are so much bigger, you would end up using a lot more paper, I think, to come up with the same amount of problems. Um, they do have a big poster that you can use for the tens house and the units house and there's a mansion house. I just copied these two because that's what we were working with. and It was kind of bulky to take the big poster out, but you'll see that these fit. You could easily make a poster board with the right size for the Unifix cubes and make a house for each of those and they just have a line underneath. You can laminate it, or maybe if you put uh, some clear tape, um, packing tape or something, at the bottom of your poster board, and they can write on that with a, an erasable marker, um, a wet erase marker. So it's doable. You can manage with it. As you get to different levels, you'll see that different worksheets will require more or less of the, you know, the blocks that actually fit on here. Here's a page where these are to size. So my seven would fit on here for seven plus one. However, if you look through most of this, this is the alpha book. As you look through most of this, you'll see there, is, there are not many pages that require you to have the blocks the right size. So um, this workbook would be an easier one to use without the blocks. They do use them, it seems so far, um, a bit but as you go through the primer, this is the kindergarten level, um, you wouldn't need them as much because you're reviewing, or you're getting a preview of various topics that come later and you don't need them as much. So can it be done? Yes. Um, is it a little bit more work? Yes. But I don't think it's so bad that you have to go out and spend lots of money for these. If you already have Unifix um, and you have enough colors and they're close enough to the Matthew C blocks, I think that it, it should be an easy, a somewhat easy thing to do. Um, if you don't have the same colors, maybe a little bit more difficult to do. Um, and they do fall, you know, these fall apart, um, or come apart, I should say, which can be a good thing or a bad thing. One other thing I'll point out is in other levels, like for subtracting, oh, let me get this right, that one goes that way. Um, you know, if it's 4 minus 1, there's your minus 1, so then you have 3. So it's nice to have these because they flip over. So later on, if you're doing a negative 4 and a pos positive 1, then you have a negative 3. So there are benefits to having these if you're going to go through the whole program. But if you're just trying it out to start out and you already have these, I say go for it, give it a try. See how you like it. You can always buy these later if you want to have them. Okay, if you have any comments or questions, leave them below.